Hey, what's up everybody? It's Fitzy back here with another pro parent tip. So today we're going to be talking about how to properly pump up the tires on your kid's bike. Yep, pretty simple topic and how extremely frustrating can it be sometimes. <laughs> like all I want to do is get out and ride and I can't get the stupid pump to work. Every time I put the pump on, the tire comes out of the, the pressure, the air comes out of the tire is what I'm trying to say. Yeah, you ever had that happen? You go to put air in and all that happens is the air comes out. All right, well I'm gonna show you a couple things so that doesn't happen. And first of all, I wanna talk about this little buddy right here, which is your valve cap. And you know what? Don't worry about this valve cap. It doesn't matter if you have it or not. People always come in the bike shop stressed about not having their valve cap. Don't worry about it. If you have one on there, that's fine. If you don't, it doesn't matter. It's not a critical part of the bike. Okay, so here's our pump. Don't judge me. It's not the world's prettiest pump, uh, but it gets the job done. And it's pretty similar to most pumps out there where there's a head and there's a lever right there. And everyone always forgets, does the lever go up or does the lever go down? And I'll tell you, the lever stays down first when you put on the pump. We're gonna push this on, and then once the pump is on, then the lever gets pulled up. And that's intended to create a seal around that valve. Okay, so we've got the pump on correctly, the lever is pulled up. If at this point you hear that means the air is coming out, not going in. So try to reposition your head. Take it off, put it back on until all that noise goes away. Lift up the lever, and that should create a seal so the air is not leaking out. Okay, from there, you just start pumping away, right? You know how this part works. Yeah, pretty simple. How far do you go? What's the right pressure? Don't worry about it. You want enough air in there where it feels firm? If you want to get specific about it, yeah, sure, maybe it's 30 pounds of pressure probably a good place to be but again don't stress about the number it doesn't matter how much the the gauge says just what does it feel like and it should feel about like a, like a soccer ball you know firm if you can really squish it down and push it, it there's probably not enough air in there if you you know go to push on it and it's super super firm like an overinflated basketball that's not gonna be very fun to ride it's gonna be a really harsh ride for your kid so, look at this. I can push in it a little bit with my thumb. It's got a little bit of give. That's a good tire pressure. You're trying to get out there, you're trying to go for a ride, your kid's trying to go for a ride, you got more things to worry about than having the perfect tire pressure. Just make sure there is air in there and it's, it's generally good enough, okay? All right, that's it. Pro parent tip on how to pump up the tires. Yep, you already lost the valve cap, doesn't matter. Don't stress about it. Get enough tire pressure in there to be safe and comfortable. And remember, the lever, once the head goes on, pulls up. That's all you need to remember. All right, get out there and ride.